Hello everyone, today we will learn how to use the platform manager in Manage Screen. We will use the same scene as the last tutorials, but instead of destroying the blue door, this time we will open it by moving it. To do that, we need to add a component called platform manager. The platform manager inherits from uh, the actor manager, so you've, you can set up the same attributes as the actor manager, gravity, mass, etc. But the main difference here is that you have a patterns list. So let's add one. Each pattern is composed of a name. We strongly recommend you to set a name to each pattern because uh, we will use it to play a pattern with the interaction manager. We call it open door. Next, uh, the pattern is defined by a list of, <coughs> of move. And each move is a move of one tile in the grid in the given direction. We will use north east with the given speed, let's set six. And you can also set up a Z speed to move up or down your, uh, your object. An acceleration, that means it will go faster and faster through time. And a waiting time before do this move. We'll add a second one. Here, so a second tile on the grid, northeast, and we need to set in northwest. You can add a camera check amount uh, during this pattern. We will not put one because the door is not a massive one. But uh, for instance, if you're creating a, a massive rock uh, that needs to move, you can here set a camera check. Last, you can play a pattern start. Minus one means no pattern will, play, will be played. If you put zero here, we'll play the first pattern on the list. And if obstructed here uh, is the behavior that uh, the platform manager will uh, apply when it is uh, blocked by another object. Stop means that the pattern is stopped. You, you get wait. That means that the object will wait uh, since, the, since the object that obstructs the path will move. Push, it will try to push the object that obstructs the path. And next pattern will just jump to the next pattern. So let's, may, let's uh, set wait because if the player is here or anything else, we just want the door to wait before uh, retrying to do the pattern. Okay, <clears throat> so uh, let's just see if the pattern is working. And it is. So we need to open the door uh, by the in player interaction, not by itself at, on game start. So, we'll add uh, an interaction manager and as in the last, uh, last tutorials, we'll add an interaction, hit on start, and the type of the trigger will be hit, object self, we need to hit the door, and action here will uh, set a callback as well, add one, we need to set the door references here. But this time in function, we need to, to uh, take uh, not primitive on this remapper as last time, but platform manager and play mm, here. And we need to give the name of the pattern, open door. Let's just verify it's the same and test it. So now, when we interact with the door, it will play the pattern. Uh, be careful because um, this will play the pattern multiple times because we have we haven't set any um, any protection for that. So be aware. But it works. Thank you for watching. I hope everything was clear. In the next tutorial, we will see how to create a door using the platform manager and a trigger with the interaction manager 
that will open the door when the player enters it and close the door when the player exits it. See you next time!